there, my name is Lynette. Welcome or welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today, I will be taking you through another simple tutorial. We are going to be focusing on account upgrade. This is for professionals on the Adisasa platform. Not all the processes on the Adisasa platform can be initiated by a normal public account. Therefore, the platform provides a way for professionals to upgrade their accounts in order to transact. So I'm going to be giving you a couple of examples just to create some context. For most land registration services, you will require to have an advocate to initiate the process on your behalf. As for survey processes, they will require a surveyor to submit the application. With a normal public account, you will only be privy to the applications that have been made on your behalf by a professional, but you cannot initiate the applications on your own. Some of the professional accounts on the platform include a licensed surveyor, practicing advocate, registered county physical planner, and a registered physical planner. There are a couple of things I would like you to pay attention to before you commence on this account upgrade process. So first and foremost, if your names do not match the names in your documents, you will need to upload an affidavit confirming that the names in your documents and those in your ID are indeed the same person. Kindly consult your advocate for assistance with the same. Kindly be keen on punctuation, especially for advocates. Ensure to insert the full stop that is normally in your admission number and do not add a space where there is none. Ensure to enter your admission number as per your practicing certificate. As you can see on the screen, I have illustrated two ways in which your admission number can be written. The first way is how it is written in your practicing certificate, and the second way is how it is written in your admission certificate. Kindly go by the way it is written in your practicing certificate. If you do not have a current practicing certificate, a receipt will not suffice. Kindly do not upload the same. So let's start off with the license surveyor. The following are the requirements that are needed for this process. So a scanned copies of your practicing certificate, registration certificate, and any other supporting documents, e.g. your ID card. In order to initiate any process on the platform, you will have to log in. So kindly do the same. Click on account on the left side panel. Click on update settings. On the right hand side, you will see the account upgrade form. Kindly select your profession by clicking on the drop down list. Select license surveyor. Input your license number as it appears in your practicing certificate. Upload your current practicing certificate by clicking on the upload button and selecting the file from your local storage. Upload your registration certificate by clicking on the upload button and selecting the file from your local storage. Upload any other supporting documents by clicking on the upload button and selecting the individual files from your local storage. Once you are done, click on the upgrade account button. A pop-up shall notify you of a successful account upgrade request. Soon thereafter, the system redirects you to the upgrade activity page where the account upgrade request is listed. You can be able to track the status of your application by clicking on the view button. Once your request is approved or rejected, you shall receive a notification on your registered phone number and on the notification bell on the platform. In the instance your application is denied, you will be furnished with the reasons for the rejection. Kindly adhere to the remarks and reapply for an account upgrade. Let's move on to our practicing advocate. So the following are the requirements. Scan copies of your practicing certificate, admission certificate, and any other supporting document, e.g. ID card. Again, in order to initiate any process on the platform, you will be required to log in. Click on account on the left side panel. Click on update settings. On the right hand side, you will see the account upgrade form. Select your profession by clicking on the drop down list and selecting an advocate. Input your admission number as it appears in your practicing certificate. Upload your current practicing certificate by clicking on the upload button and selecting the file from your local storage. Upload the certificate of admission by clicking on the upload button and selecting the file from your local storage. Upload any other supporting documents by clicking on the upload button and selecting the individual files from your local storage. Once you are done, click on the upgrade account button. A pop-up shall notify you of a successful account upgrade request. Soon thereafter, the system redirects you to the upgrade activity page where the account upgrade request is listed. You can be able to track the status of your application by clicking on the view button. Once your request is approved or rejected, you shall receive a notification on your registered phone number and on the notification bell on the platform. If your application is denied, you will be furnished with the reasons or recommendations for your rejection. Kindly adhere to the same and reapply for an account upgrade. Let's look at a registered physical planner. 
The following are the requirements. Scan copies of your practicing certificate, registration certificate, and any other supporting documents. To initiate this process, kindly log in. Click on account on the left side panel. Click on update settings. On the right hand side, you will see the account upgrade form. Select your profession by clicking on the drop down list and selecting registered physical planner. Input your registration number as it appears in your registration certificate. Upload your current practicing certificate by clicking on the upload button and selecting the file from your local storage. Upload your registration certificate by clicking on the upload button and selecting the file from your local storage. Upload any other supporting documents by clicking on the upload button and selecting the individual files from your local storage. Once you are done, click on upgrade account button. A pop-up shall notify you of a successful account upgrade request. Soon thereafter, the system redirects you to the upgrade activity page where the account upgrade request is listed. You can be able to track the status of your application by clicking on the view button. Once your request is approved or rejected, you shall receive a notification on your registered phone number and on the notification bell on the platform. In the instance your application is denied, you will be furnished with reasons as to why. Kindly adhere to the remarks and reapply for an account upgrade. So this marks the end of our tutorial. Kindly do not hesitate to ask us any questions in the comment section or better yet, you can reach out to our customer service agents who will be ready and willing to assist you with the same. Kindly like, share and subscribe for more informative videos. Thank you.